Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to update you regarding two small changes that could be rolling out to Copilot for the desktop for Windows 11, which in effect is really just a Bing Chat web container that's now available for some on the Windows 11 desktop after updating to Moment 4. And the second regarding Copilot in the side panel which is the Bing Copilot for the web. Now starting with uh, Copilot for the web in Microsoft Edge, currently in the stable version of Edge and also uh, the preview versions. If you click on the reload button, this is currently what the icon looks like. So just one more look at that, there we go. So that's currently what the Copilots for the web icon looks like when you re reload uh, that in this side panel. Now, if we head over to a screenshot provided by Leo once again on X, there could be a small little change coming to that icon. And there you can see if you click on that reload, that's currently a new icon that could be rolling out to the Copilot for the web in Microsoft Edge. Just one more look at that, and we can see looking a little bit different to what it currently looks like uh, in Microsoft Edge. So that's the first change. So we could be expecting a Copilot for the web. Um, a little new logo for Edge's Copilot. Now, moving on to the desktop version of Copilot, which in effect is really just a Bing Chat web container. And it's also to do with the reload refresh button. But this time, if we head to the three dotted menu, more options, yeah, you can see the refresh button for the desktop is located in the ellipsis three dotted menu. And once again, if we head over to another screenshot provided by Leo, yeah, you can see that Microsoft could be changing uh, that refresh button and they could be making a, that small change uh, in Windows Copilot and the refresh button could appear directly in the header and will no longer be hidden in the ellipsis menu as mentioned. And just two small little um, changes I wanted to bring to your attention as obviously um, Copilot, uh, be that for the web and also for the desktop, are relatively new features and these could be changes that Microsoft is bringing uh, to both uh, Copilot for the desktop and also for the web version. And just wanted to keep you posted and in the loop if you would be interested. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.